guys how's it going i just thought i'd make a quick video for the channel um just kick start it and just let you know about why i'm doing it what the plans are for it and what the future is for it um so more or less um uh, the reason that i got interested in starting a channel was because i kept seeing a lot of other people in their collections showing off what they've got what cool bits that have been sent through um sometimes it's the case that it's stuff that have never been released in the uk um sometimes it's japan only america um or it's press kits press kits are something that always interests me because game developers give them to a select number of people and without youtubers i'd never even know they existed for certain games and they are amazing um because like i said they're like mini collector's editions um so it's just great as a collector and a fan of something to know there's something extra out there um even if it's something that i'll never be able to own then at least i know it existed so just appreciate it and admire it from a distance <laughs> um so with that like i said i um and regular everyday YouTube is showing off what they've got. When I'm undecided about buying something for the gaming room, I'll often uh, turn to YouTube because someone's already owned it, bought it, collected it, got it, and will then uh, be the decision maker for me. Because sometimes you buy something and you're just like, that wasn't worth the money I spent on it. And then other times you're just like, well, what's actually in the box? And uh, thanks to YouTube these days, a lot of people have already done an unboxing. So um, I figure I, my room is filled to the rim with tons of different things, whether it's Lego, whether it's still books, whether it's gaming uh, collectibles, um, Legos, uh various other things vinyls comic books art books there's just a lot to see a lot that captures my attention so i'm sure if i'm a fan of something someone else is also a fan um so it's about meeting new people maybe showing off something that you didn't know existed that you want in your collection maybe um catching up with someone that knows something that i don't like for example with my comic books there's always a variant cover that seems to elude me because i don't know where i can buy it from um so i have to go without um so maybe there's someone out there that knows of a retailer or even a, a comic book owner um that also can get them ordered in uh, it's just basically finding other people with the same interests as me um so that's basically why i want to start up the channel as for the channel itself what i want to do with it mainly going to be unboxing and showing off bits that i do get through the door um to kind of give back what i got um it, some of it might be old just because the the games that I've got, some of them are old and they're just cool bits that uh, you might not have seen. You might have, might have forgotten that you even own. Um, or, like I said, for me, sometimes it's the old stuff that I didn't know existed and then it gives me an opportunity to go and get it. Um, as for uh, other things, uh, there will be game reviews as well as I figure out how to do that. I know how to record footage, but I don't really know how to edit it. So it's the same with the channel at the moment. I'm afraid the video quality that you're getting at the moment isn't great. And also any mistakes I make are going to have to stay in because I don't know how to take them out. <laughs> um, I promise I will learn how to take all this stuff out, edit it. It's all a learning procedure for me and I will take the time and figure it out. Um, so if you have got any suggestions on microphones, uh, camera, uh any great tutorials and things like that by all means link them let, let me know in the comments um i'm always uh looking for uh, help and assistance and whatever i'm not afraid to say that i i'm i might suck at this um but we all suck when we first start at anything and it is that ability to help grow and uh yeah like i said um i just hope that like i said i can help people the way that they've helped me um as far as uh other ideas for the channel i do want to get down the road uh do uh podcasts because me and my friends do chat about a lot of different things um so maybe even get some of you guys in it'd be great to have a debate uh especially at the moment with playstation versus xbox um that's always a fun one to talk about um also maybe go into details with some of my collections like i collect funko pops and uh, there's a lot of varieties of funko pops and when i first started i didn't know uh what a chase was i literally walked into a shop and was just like hey 
uh, could I get this one and showed him a picture of a chase? And they're like, no, because there's a one in six chance of finding a chase. And just basically, if you're passionate about something or just starting off in a collection, it does help to have a video to like explain what's going on. So some of those might help. Um, especially because I, I learned the ins and outs of everything. Um, and that's another part of it is basically just like a weekly recap of what I've learned because I follow a lot of things, whether it's to go with entertainment on the TV, like Walking Dead's coming to an end after season 11, like um, the announcement of uh, Xbox's price and release date on the November 10th. Um, Little Nightmares 2 got a collector's edition this week that I've pre-ordered, so that'll be an upcoming unboxing. And then there is also... Um, what was the other item? Oh, uh, Ubisoft uh, did its forward yesterday and uh, announced Scott Pilgrim's return after 10 years. So I'm pumped to play that. Hopefully it gets a physical collector's edition because I'll be uh, buying that if it does. Um, and then uh, they also bring back Prince of Persia Sands of Time, which I myself haven't played. So it'll be an interesting chance to jump on it. But I guess that's why they do remakes. And like I said, in some ways, that's what I hope my videos can be is maybe a recap for someone that didn't know something existed. I've done it myself, discovered a video video of something that I didn't know whether it's an old retro sonic toy or um something else to do with anime that uh, I just wasn't around or born for um and release dates as well on the anime side of things there's so few coming to the UK sometimes they get released by a company and you don't even know they're coming like Hunter x Hunter that comes out in November and I can't wait to have that in my hands um so yeah it's just basically just a geek out with some other people that also have an interest so we'll have to wait and see future plans for the channel. I also want to set up a social media account. I'll probably do that on Instagram and then tag that in there as soon as I figure out how to tell that to the channel. Cause that way, when I do get a comic book through the door, maybe it would just be worth putting up a picture of a uh, variant cover and just showing off what it is. Uh, Cause not everything's going to be worth unboxing and showing a whole video. If it is just a case that it's a cool cardboard sleeve <laughs> or a steel book. Cause sometimes a steel book, it's better just to see the front, the back, there you go. You don't really need an audio description to explain what's going on with that. So uh, hopefully I'll catch you guys in later videos. Um, but for now, I'll catch you later. Um, like all YouTubers say, like, comment and subscribe. And I'll catch you future.